What's up art fans? My name's Jesse and I'm an artist out of Phoenix, Arizona and today we are going to be painting a food truck or trailer, whatever you want to call it. But uh, this is Pit Hefe Barbecue's new trailer that they're going to be cruising the valley with and uh, they wanted to do something special. They didn't want to do just a wrap so they reached out to me and uh, they asked if I could put something together. So we are actually going to wrap the entire truck in a mural, but we're gonna start with this section just behind me, and then we're actually gonna do the back area over here. So we're gonna put some contact info so that anybody who's driving behind them can easily get a hold of them. And then on this side, we are going to do an epic piece that really tells people what this authentic Arizona barbecue truck is really all about. So uh, we've got a lot of work to do, and we are gonna do a step-by-step -step process of how to paint a food truck so if that's what you're doing follow along and if you're just excited to see this come to life it's gonna be rad so yeah we've got no time to waste let's make it happen So we've got it taped off, we've got the sketch down, it went smooth, it went quick, we are ahead of schedule, which is fantastic. And uh, we're gonna start adding a little bit of color to the background, we're gonna start putting that sky in and making this thing pop. I'm so stoked and I can't wait, but uh, yeah, let's go. So it's starting to rain and uh, it's gonna be coming down a little bit harder than I'd like in a minute here. We've got a storm system rolling through. So we're gonna pack it up for tonight and uh, see what things look like in the morning.
those clouds aren't looking too good, we'll keep an eye on them, see how it goes. So we've got the uh, panel on the back complete, we've got the rear panels done, we've got the front section pretty much complete, and now we have this last empty side. So uh, we've got a whole new composition. This is the customer facing side, so we're gonna have a little bit of fun with it. There's gonna be a chalkboard sign so they can write all of their daily specials on there. And this is gonna be just another fun piece to kind of complete the entire food truck slash trailer, right? And uh, I can't believe it. It's looking so good, it's so colorful and I can't wait to complete this one. So we got no time to waste. Let's make it happen. Now I'm not a writer. Okay. Are you listening? Damn. Okay, so we almost got swept away by the wind yesterday. That was absolutely wild. Uh, we had to pack it up quick, but we're back today. Uh, the tent did get a little bit of damage up here, so it's holding on by a thread. But you know what? We're gonna we're gonna rock it out today. Definitely some uh, more storms and wind on the way, but we're gonna paint as long as we can today. And uh, yeah, as always, we're gonna make it happen. So let's go.
Okay guys, so we got all of the color knocked out, all of the outline knocked out, all of the verbiage knocked out. Everything looks good. Now the final step is going to be sealing it so that it's protected uh, against UV, uh, against weather, and just uh, give it that overall longevity so that it's got as long a vibrancy as possible. And in order to do that, we are going to use Mural Shield. Uh, this is a fantastic product. Uh, it's one of many that this company offers, world's best graffiti. And uh, for this particular project, I thought this was really the optimum choice. It works well with spray paint and uh, it offers all of the security and protection that uh, this food trailer or food truck is gonna need. So for application, we're gonna go ahead and use our trusty sprayer. And because the metal is such a slick surface and there's no real uh, nooks and crannies for the sealant to uh, kind of go in, we're gonna follow up with a brush. So basically we'll spray a little section and then we'll go through uh, with the brush and we'll kind of fan it out. And then, I don't know, I might need a roller. We'll see, we'll assess kind of once we're doing it. But uh, about two or three coats should do it. And then we're gonna do the final little touch of the chalkboard and we're gonna call this piece good. So a little bit of weather on the horizon. We'll see how it treats us, but uh, yeah, we got a small window, so let's make it happen. Okay guys, that's a wrap. We are all done with this massive food truck slash trailer, whatever you wanna call it. But we wrapped it all the way around and uh, it is big, bright, bold, and beautiful. Everything I was hoping it would be. The client loves it. I can't wait to find out what kind of impression it makes on uh, the people that are coming and buying barbecue uh, when the truck finally gets to make its debut. So that's gonna be a lot of fun. But if you've got any questions, leave them in the comment section down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, you can always scope out what I'm up to on Instagram, at Mr. Downtown Phoenix. And if you wanna see uh, what I've got for sale, merch or paintings, or if you needed to inquire about a mural, then you can visit my website, www.shinethroughart.com. And uh, yeah, once again, thanks so much for watching. We finished this piece up just in the nick of time because uh, that storm I was keeping an eye on earlier, it looks like it's starting to settle in. So I'm gonna get packed up and uh, I'm hungry. So I'm gonna go get a bite to eat. But uh, as always, thanks again for watching and I'll catch you at the next wall.
。完了完了完了 ，barbecue 了，真的 barbecue 了，真的完蛋了。